Green Cane, now when was emergency? My mom, she's really bad. She's in, she hasn't been out of the bed in like three days. She, ever since she moved in with this guy out here, all she does is drink. She's turning yellow. The last time I saw her was like a week ago. She had lost like so much weight. There's like nothing left to her. And now my brother just said that she's laying in the bed like making noises. I don't know, but we need to get her to a hospital. I just called 911 thinking that they would send an ambulance to my mom. I told him what was wrong and he didn't want to send an ambulance and I pretty much begged him and I told him that she was going to die if she didn't get help and he told me to call back after I got there and I told him that there was no service and why would I call back if he didn't want to send an ambulance the first time. She hemorrhaged through her esophagus into her stomach. So I feel if she would have went to the hospital, basically she could have gotten blood transfusions that would have, you know, helped her not die from bleeding. And then they could have done surgery or at least tried to save her. Okay, is she willing to go to the hospital? She will be because I'm on my way there, so she's going. Okay. Or she's going to die. Okay, is this a police issue or because we can't force her to go in an ambulance? No, it's not a police issue. I'll get her to go in the ambulance. I would take her in my car, but I don't think I'd be able to get her in the car because she can't even move. I want them to make changes. Um, This should have never happened, and I don't want it to ever happen again to another family. Nobody should have to go through this. And I want him held accountable. If she was making other people happy and giving, that's what made her happy. She never worried about herself. She was so selfless.